In this tutorial, we'll be walking through the process of creating a deep motion animate 3D animation with the new Roblox default character and then import it into Roblox Studio. The animations we will be importing are generated from the Deep Motion Animate 3D web service. Animate 3D is an AI powered motion capture solution that captures full body human motion. You can create 3D animations from any video that you find online or capture from a personal camera. You can sign up and try it free with free monthly recurring animation time. Moving on to our Roblox walkthrough. For step one, you're going to want to create your free Animate 3D account so that you can create your AI motion capture animation. We will soon be adding a new account walkthrough that will guide you through the process of creating your first animation. For everyday purposes here, I will go over the steps to create an animation with the normal user interface. Once you're logged in, go ahead and navigate to Animate 3D. Here you will see your personal dashboard. Go ahead and click on Create. For step two, we are going to set our 3D model to the newly built-in Roblox default character. This completely removes the need to go into Blender at all. So go ahead and click on the small edit icon. Here you can see that you already have access to the Roblox R15 character. Select it and go back to your settings. Next, upload the video you want to turn into an animation. Please be sure to review the capture guidelines below. If you don't follow these instructions, your animation may not turn out as well as it could. The quality of your animation is highly dependent on the quality of the video that you upload. Once uploaded, we can now set our animation settings. The important things to note is that the FBX output is turned on as this will be the animation file that we'll be using in Roblox Studio. Another setting you might want to consider is the physics filter setting, which will help prevent your character's mesh from intersecting. Other options that you can explore with a subscription include foot locking settings for better foot contact depending on the motion, animation smoothing, which will help remove jitters, and speed multiplier, which will allow you to capture slow-mo videos. Here, face tracking is not available to use with Roblox characters at this time. However, it is a free option to use with other models. Once you're ready, go ahead and create your animation. Here, you can double check all of your settings then you can click start job to begin processing the animation. The animation generation should only take a few minutes with default options selected. After it's finished, you can take a look at how your animation turned out in the previewer. And once you're ready, you can download your animation. Again, we are using the FBX output. Now let's go ahead and move over to Roblox Studio. You can download and install this for free in case you don't have it yet. Roblox Studio is an essential building tool that allows you to create custom experiences for Roblox. Once in Roblox Studio, select your template or project you'd like to use for importing your animation. I'm going to use just the classic base plate. Next, we want to load in an R15 character to match the default character we had in Animate 3D. Navigate to plugins at the top, then to build rig. You can use any R15 character you wish here. I'm going to use the block rig. Once loaded in, I'm going to move my character down to the origin. You can do this by simply inputting 030. Okay, great. Now I'm just going to navigate around to get a view of the front of my character. Okay, perfect. Now we are ready to load in the animation we just created. Go back up to the plugins tab and click on animation editor. Here you'll see the editor load in at the bottom. Now we can just click on our character and we can name our new animation. I'm going to name mine deep motion test and then click create. Now we can click on these three dots here, go down to import and then down to import FBX animation. From here, navigate to where you save your Animate 3D FBX animation that we just downloaded. The animation files you downloaded from Animate 3D came in a zip folder. Go ahead and double click that folder to get your animation files. Be sure to select the animation that does not have the T-pose in the name. You should see the animation immediately load in. And there we go. 
AI motion capture from video to Roblox Studio in just a few minutes. If you have any questions, comments, or even ideas on partnering with us, reach out to us anytime. We would love to hear from you.